chat. Welcome to the bakery. I hope you are ready for something a lot of us have been waiting for some time. Finally, we get Poppy Playtime Chapter 3. Now, if you'll notice, the chat over here, there's no chat. It's because I'm not looking at you guys. Uh, the game's been out for like 10 hours, and I am terrified of spoilers. And you should be too. So look at chat very carefully until we're done the game. I will specify, the song playing right now is not something I commissioned or, nor created. This is the Stupendium's The Toy Box. It is their uh, Poppy Playtime song, specifically the instrumental. Very, very good. Um, I thought it would be great to use to introduce the stream and kind of talk about what we're going to do today. Um, Will I still look at donos? Donos are turned on. If you're going to spoil the game, you at least have to pay. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, keep in mind, any random asshole can just pop in and... Wait, you know what? Hold on. I'm going to make chat a little bit safer for you guys. All right. It's not foolproof, because there are definitely some assholes that are subscribed to me. But at least some random douchebag who nobody knows can't just pop in and spoil it. Now, only people who have been subscribed to the channel for at least 20 minutes can talk in chat. So hopefully, that cuts out a lot of the issues. I don't know if it will or not, but um, regardless, as much as I love this song, and it's one of my favorites by Stupendium, We've got bigger fish to fry, so let me just close Spotify. Should have done that with the help on a two stream. I should have. I kind of forget that I have that option. I never really use it, so I forget that it exists. Um. I am like taking peeks at chat, but I'm not. I'm trying to avoid looking at chat too much. Uh, but let's play a video game, shall we? Um, I am completely blind to what this will be. Why is it like weird? Is it because it's not? Hold on. Let's make it full screen. That might help. There we go. Um, hopefully that volume is good. I am so excited for this. So as some of you may know, Poppy Playtime Chapter 1 and 2. I enjoyed. I thought they were fun games. I just didn't think they were very scary. Already, that fucking thing, a huge, massive step up in creature design. Look at this fucking thing. It is disgusting. I am very excited. Um, I guess new game for chapter? Because, like, I haven't played it yet. Previous save data. I don't have it. I don't... I surely I don't hit continue. New game. What's the time? Playtime! Uh, if you were paying attention, this was on Twitter and YouTube about a month or so ago. So, very excited. Unless there's going to be something new here. Obnoxious, you would be attracted to the cat, huh? Huh. Yeah, I'll do a summary after the uh, cutscene, White Wolf. Hey, we'll be okay, guys. I promise. All winds blow away. Eventually. Please, 
help us go to sleep, Catnap. We need it, Catnap. Please help us. Sleep, sleep, sleep. <laughs> Obnoxious super chatted two dollars. That cat is hot. God damn it! Right in the middle of the cutscene too. <laughs> Everyone knows Huggy Wuggy and Poppy Playtime, but are your children safe from Playtime Co.'s latest toy? What you've seen here is Playtime Co.'s own Smiling Critters, a limited series cartoon meant to celebrate the release of the toys sharing its name. Yet both now face the fire sparked by the inclusion of one key member. This is Catnap. And like the others of his line, you just pull his little tail and seems innocent enough. However, parents across the country report their children experiencing strange and often violent nightmares. And beside them, their little grinning catnap doll. Now with controversy growing, Playtime Co. has announced the recall of all catnap toys from the Smiling Critters line. His image cleared from all promotional material. But damage already done, will disappearing be that easy? The exact cause of these incidents still unknown, only one thing appears glaringly certain. Your children are not safe with catnap. I think of the 14 months ember. I do not know what the fuck that is. I'll have to look at the Discord later. I saw your tag on Twitter. I just haven't had time to, like, know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> Game's a bit quiet. Uh, yeah, I can turn it up a bit. I was worried that it would, like, get louder, you know? Oh, fuck. Were we being carried? Okay, hold on. Let me turn up the game a little bit. All right. Let me know how that is. Oh, oh, we got to go. It's very, um, right away, it's very end of Portal 1, and I'm loving it, where we're, like, in between the shit. Um, let me know if this is too loud, by the way. It looks, like, graphically a huge upgrade from 1 to 2. supposed to go there, I guess. Or underneath one of these. Did I die? O oops. I guess that took too long. Uh, summary, right. So for anyone who hasn't seen the first two games, this is going to be very confusing. Um, but a very brief summary. We were presumably an employee at this factory that makes toys. And, um, we were called back to the factory from a letter that was essentially saying, like, Everybody disappeared, but we're still here. Come find us. We get there. And, uh, we... F oh, hello, Wookiebot. 
I don't know which way is the correct way. I want to look around some more first. We get there and we find that um, the toys are not only alive, but they're hostile. Um, and as we go, I don't know if it's explored too much in the game proper rather than like online teasers and other things like that. But it's, we're coming to learn that these toys were experiments to like put essentially make people into toys uh, but that's pretty much all you need to know and then context for this game we were helping poppy who was helping us escape and she seemed to have turned on us um at the end of the last game and instead of letting us out sent us deeper in saying that we need to help um and then we kind of the train we were on crashed and we passed out There's, there's so much more lore. But there's your brief summary for anyone who does not know. So far, this game looks beautiful. I might turn up the brightness a smidgen, because my... Um... I guess I'll turn up the gamma, then. Okay, that's better. My, my monitor is very dark, so it was getting, like, just legitimately hard to see. We almost did it. Yeah, graphically, like, not saying the first two games look bad. The first two games graphically were fine. But immediately, this is like... It's like it with Help Wanted 2, right? Like, Help Wanted 1 was, a, like, a, a very, like, good-looking game. But somehow, Help Wanted 2 was, like, leads better. Chapter 1 and 2 for this were, like, decently look Like, they looked fine. But somehow, the, Chapter 3 already is, like, crazy high fidelity. <laughs> oh, you know what? I didn't tweet that we're live. Let me do that. While I respawn, because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Hey, Lunar Light with the Incredible Cat two dollars. True. First of all, that was your first super chat. Thank you very much. Um, but yeah, everyone should like the stream because it helps it in the algorithm. I think. I don't actually know. But oh, 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 he lurking. Okay. One of my um. One of my biggest complaints with Chapter 2 was that Mommy Longlegs, as a design, isn't that conceptually scary, but it also did, it was done a disservice because, oh, hold on, let me, my timer's up, let me write this tweet. Lunar Light Super Chatted $2, remember to like stream everyone. Okay, the tweet is live. Um, Dusky, it's an incredibly kind two months. Remember, everyone, spoilers are very rude. True, spoilers get banned permanently. Um, but I, one of my complaints, if anyone saw my chapter two critique video, was that, like, no matter how cool of a monster they make, showing the entire body so early and just like in a brightly lit environment kind of did it a disservice. And that was my idea with mommy. That was my my complaint with Mommy Longlegs, was that, like, as a design, she works if she's, like, slinking through a back room or, like, just a hand is going through. But when she's just all in front of you in a brightly lit area, she's less threatening. So I, that's the thing that I really hope. And seeing from the trailer... um, Oh, poor Bonzo. And from the gameplay already, it seems like they might be 
uh, hopefully the direction this game is going is closer to that where like they keep their cards close to their chest you know well thank you Dragonheart did I just walk by the oh yeah okay Inventory. Let's see. All right, Miss Harper. Please explain the situation. Spare no detail. Well, luck any not, all the children were getting sleep. It was peaceful, quiet. Catnap had the red smoke in the room. Then suddenly, there was this scream. Nightmares happen, I know. But this, I mean, dilated pupils and quivering lips. The way her eyes darted around the room, and I swear, her hand and mine, it felt like her blood was boiling beneath her skin. She saw something, too. Something horrible. She... Uh, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Miss Harper, we'll provide the very best care we can offer. You have my word. But this is important. Did Marie happen to describe what she saw? Yes! A monster, she said, said that it was colorless. Gosh, I could feel the poor little heart pounding. For her, it was right there. A and her movements, they were so wild. Arms flailing, legs kicking. Hmm. I, I wanted to talk to her, see how she's doing. I, I just, I really need to hear her voice right now. That would not be advised, Miss Harper. There are many concerns we must address at this time. But vital, show normal, and we'll continue to monitor. She'll be okay. No! Well, pardon me if I'm not comforted by that. <laughs> Just bring my little girl back to me. <laughs> okay. Um, stay energized. So, uh, some other theories that have been going on around this game, it seems pretty clear that the children at the on-site orphanage that was talked about in the first teaser were the test subjects of making these kids into toys. Um, oh, this is where we were dropped off in the beginning. Got it, got it. Um, love the huggy couch, by the way. And that definitely seems like one of those outcomes, if I had to guess. Okay, we need batteries. Got it. No. Oh. Aha. What did that say? The Hour of Joy. That was another thing. A lot of the trailers leading up to this game kept saying the Hour of Joy is at hand. And it was never explained what that is. I think logically it could be um, the prototype freeing everybody. It could be something else that was related to um, the kids being tested on. My theory, uh, one of the names is broken in the higher up hallway. And I thought that, and most people think that's our character. Um, but the letters there have J, O, and Y in it. So I forget what the name I came up with was, but it was a name that had Joy as part of the last name. So the Hour of Joy would be when our character comes to free everybody, was the theory that I'm going for. Uh, obnoxious with the two months of membership. Thank you very much. Classic Obnoxious Horn DTM aside, this is already really cool. Can't wait to see where this goes, right? I'm Bubba Bubba Fint. Hey, I remember you. An elephant always remembers. Want to know what I remember about you? Sure. <laughs> so it got creepy at the end, but that first, there was a little I'm bit of a blah, 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 in the middle of the screen hey, that kind of got me. I remember you. What?
Okay, I guess we gotta do a puzzle to get to it. That's not Poppy. Whoa! Did you do that? I guess that's where Catnap found you. I know you're that probably mad is at where we crashed. for not letting you escape. But she needs you. We need you. You are our mission. Together, we can save a lot of people. Including you. Ollie sounds so cute. Grab the handle and rotate the beam with QB. Okay. What? Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Very, uh, por again, very portal esque mechanic, which I, I'm down with. Huh. Hey, Boxy Boo. Everyone's favorite. I love Boxy Boo. He's so silly. Hey, I'm Chicken Chicken. Want to go outside and hang out? PJ Pokepillar, my favorite boy. It's looking pretty bad outside. I've never been outside before. Oh, poor Chicken Chicken. Will you come with me? I'm scared. Here, follow me. I'll step out first. So leaving killed them? I wonder if... Because in the teaser videos, we see that uh, Huggy Wuggy escapes at some point and is recaptured. I wonder if eventually something is added to prevent them from leaving. Uh, notably, treat yourself at Playtime's new park. There's an amusement park down here? Bro, if we get haunted amusement park, I'm a, I'm going to be hype. Again, joy being everywhere. That opens that got it. Uh, no time like the present. Because the poppy guys have some kind of poison so they can't leave. Possibly. I'm not sure. Catnap stopping them from leaving also makes a lot of sense. That it was just Catnap being like, oh, you're going to leave? No, you're not. Hello. My name is Elliot Ludwig. When you look around at the world today... What one thing do you think it needs more of? I asked around once. Money, I never have enough. Understanding, I can never get any. Faith, the common man has lost it. Each answer was different. And I could perhaps see some little truth in each. 
but I think each was also missing something. Something simple. You see, not one of them could muster a smile. A smile is hope. A smile is love. Oh. A smile oh is my god, this is massive. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for this a is child's fucking smile. massive. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. Holy shit. It is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One okay, yeah, they, they can protected. fit a fucking amusement park down After here. All, what the hell? This company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile. They deserve to love. And they deserve a safe home. That is why it is with enormous pleasure that as the founder of Playtime Co., I announce... Playcare! Our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that. It's a school. A playhouse, a place to belong. Our very own ecosystem beneath the surface, dedicated in every inch and detail to ensuring a child's smile. It's teachers and counselors, mothers and fathers, until such a time they have all of that in you. May play care bring joy, inspiration, and smiles to all who enter these doors. For what gives life its meaning if not a smile? That's crazy. So by the way, if you see me snacking, I bought these Oreo mint thins the other day. They taste like just like a fucking um thin mint. It's crazy. It's the little duck paddle boats. I love those. Um, I mean, I guess if we're powering on the play care, we should do that before we run all over the place. See if anything changes. Um, I love the brawn street lamps. Crafty corn, a conscious observer. Oh, is that who's going to be above us? Okay, got it. Of, of both color and creativity in the world. Crafty Corn understands the importance of art and sharing it with others. Crayons, pencils, paint, or words on the page. Unicorn can see beauty in anything about it. Hey, I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Pass me the book, please. Hey, I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Hey, I remember you. Hey, Bubba Bubba Prince. Hey, okay, so this will have I the first phrase you. of all the crowd outs then. Brains of the critters, bright and attentive. He keeps his friends steady and always steers them to make smart choices. That way they all might grow up to be bright and brilliant, each in their own right. So Catnaps was the one that was destroyed. Understandable. Seems pretty bad. Yeah. The cool kid of the crew maintains that sense of cool throughout anything, even the most sensitive situations. Knock him down, poke himself back up, brush, up, brush himself off, and ask what's next. Bobby Bear Hug. Kind, caring soul shows compassion for everyone and everything. People and places and things, large or small, are all receivers of her love. Each is enriched by the uh, by this attention and affection, and in turn, so is she. Dog day. Dog day says, 
fetched. Sending strong and determined leader of the critters. Each trusts him to find the bright side in any situation, and have a friendly word of encouragement should they feel down. They'll always keep his friends going no matter what. Piggy, Just piggy. Under the statue. Ali, I am reading. Hi there, I'm Piggy Piggy. Let's eat. What's more important than play and learning? Picky Piggy knows the answer. A playful body and keen mind are fueled by what's put into them, which is why she encourages her friends to eat a well-balanced diet. A well-balanced diet. Secretly, PB and J's are her favorite food. Hoppy Hopscotch. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. You wanna try hopping to the moon with me? Unafraid to hop wherever other where others might sit. Hoppy is the friend everyone needs to maintain their energy and enthusiasm. Well, sometimes louder and patient, she'll always hop beside her friends, even if it means slowing up in pace. Slowing up once in a while to keep their pace. Okay, and crafty corn. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, I see it. Thank you, Ollie. There we go. Simple as. Not super... Okay, is that... Okay, it's falling apart. I was like, the fact that I can see out into this abyss isn't great, but I, I see it's falling apart. Gregory, I mean Ollie. Yeah, right. Be cat. Or cat be. Watch your step. Don't forget your mask. Already? Oh, already. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Welcome to the gas production zone. The beating heart of the whole evil play care system. Gas you see coming from the machine is made right here in the factory. It's called the Red Smoke. Right now, it's all headed off to the right. We need to make that Red Smoke go left instead. That's how we can get to him. The machine will probably have a few dumb safeguards for you to work around, but I think you can do it. I'll call you once it's done. Okay, so that doesn't do anything yet. Oh, here we go. What about this? No. I guess we'll just head through this door. Because I'm not seeing much else to interact with in here yet. Oh, we still haven't heard Catnab's voice. Okay, so he's just gonna be creepy at us. Okay, so there's a gate there we need to open at some point. Yes, I saw the battery, don't worry, I just wanna assess my surroundings. We're not like, this is the like, walk in and join the daisies as we go playthrough, you know what I mean? I'm not rushing, I'm not running, I'm just trying to explore and look around. Make sure we don't miss anything. Which we probably will miss something, but the less we miss, the better, you know? Let's go plug in that thing. Oh 
shit. I didn't even realize it was a hand. Let's see what it does. Oh, shit. Extended wire length. Oh, it's longer? Let's go. Okay. I was wondering, because I saw in the trailer they did that and jumped. And in my brain, I'm like, oh, we're gonna that the game is gonna get broken wide open with this. You can only do it in specific locations. There's still probably potential for like big speedrun skips there. I just wouldn't know what it is. Interesting. Don't know how that helped. Oh. Oh wait, can I pull it like Oh, I can just <laughs> it just goes down. No way I make that, right? I can go to like here. Oh wait, oh wait, big brain. I understand now. Huge. Hmm. Oh, huge. We still need it, chat. We're learning. Okay, so already we got one of these. I need to get... This... Can I reach in from above? Okay, so yeah. That's sick. Oh, that's so fucking cool, actually. I'm loving the I, I love that puzzle. I just like wire puzzles, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, it's another one. Can I just... Like, for this one, realistically. Just... Oh, okay, so these still count as, like, power columns. All right, all right. Well, then, I want to hit this one. that huge oh, okay it said wait a second I'm just being impatient still need that blue battery but we've charged some of the oh we have to charge all of these wires I see so a lot of them are from the blue battery.
We have this now. Can we activate anything over here? Still not sure what I'm supposed to do over here. Close to you. Yeah. What's the shy cat's name and what does she look like? Uh, April, and she has long orange fur, but does not like being held. It has some power. Can I... Okay, I just needed some power. Because it does not have all of its power yet. What I do? Uh oh. Hi, Ollie. Okay, so this is the main thing we have to do, but we need access to it before we can do it. Got it. Okay. Understanding how this is working. Does she like scritches? When she comes up to you. Is my baby crying? Chat. I will be right back. Uh, I have to go help my baby.
Sorry about that, chat. Uh, baby is settled for the most part with Mama Toast. And if he starts fussing again, I'll have to uh, be right back longer. Anyway, I gotta take my fiber, because bad bitches like me have in, uh, irritable bowel syndrome. Also, for the boys, so we were getting a key from under the statues, right? IBS club. If someone made an FNF mod for you, would you play it? Fuck yeah, I'd be honored. I already like FNF. I already like Friday Night Funkin', but if someone made a Raito's Friday Night Funkin' mod, I'd play the fuck out of that. That's so sick. Got it. So all of these need to be turned on to turn on the gas. Understood. All right, to the house. Dark changes everything, true. Integrity Dabs with the Incredible Kind one month membership. Any merch coming down the line? Not at the moment. We can't really make our own in our current setup. And I don't know if um, U2s wants to collab again. And I'm waiting for the go-ahead if they do or not before I reach out to other sites. Once I know how U2s is dust settles, like if they want to keep working with me, I would be more, more than honored to continue working with them. If they don't, then I'll probably reach out to, like, Makeship or Onage, and I've got a couple ideas that I really want to do, but I, I gotta wait. These things take time. F and F, you mean Five Nights Freddy's? True. What's your job? You're looking at it. It's the best job in the world. Um, are these, like, staff members? That's really funny if so. If not, terrifying. But if they are like staff members, that's really like that's a really cute way to be like, oh hey, these people worked on the game. I, hmm. do I want? I don't know if I want to go in there, chat. Actually, I guess we gotta, huh? Is there like a gas mask nearby I can put on? Well, we inhaled whatever that was. Hmm. You know, we saw in the trailer the fucked up Huggy Wuggy. I have a feeling the that gas might be a hallucinogen. And that might be what's about to what we're about to see. Cause uh the fact that we don't have our grab pack anymore makes me think we are hallucinating. But I guess we'll find out. go this way the aesthetic i will say great this is a very unnerving aesthetic tragic news this morning as of 9 45 a.m local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late elliot ludwig an esteemed toy maker and originator of the playtime company at this time an identity for the child awaits official confirmation found in an upstairs bedroom in a large duffel bag Officers on scene report that the remains appear to have been disturbed. Organs, as well as key bones from the skeletal structure, were reported missing from the body. It is unknown at this time whether this extraction was, in fact, the cause of death. Gross. Also, looking at the markings on the walls, definitely the location of the first teaser when it was like a slow pan of an orphanage. Events, Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. 
This is what they had to say. Quote, it's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man, and those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart for children like this one, making the actions of whoever planted this body all the more sick. We look forward to clearing his good name, both in the public eye and in the eyes of the law. Stay tuned, Lamar. A clap and a half to you. We'll miss you. Oh, that's really sweet. Oh, that's really nice. That's so nice. Following recent events, Playtime Co. was asked for any comments regarding the discussion. Oh, my neck. Oh, he's got to get us out of here, man. That's not Ollie. Oh, hi, catnap. Oh, hey. Run which run, run where? Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's I also can't run yet. Ludwig's decades lend suspicion to this claim. When questioned, Ludwig's neighbors indicated that he would often return to his home in strange hours of the night. And the yeah, hell no, is right. <laughs> believed he was sick. Others that don't move, don't move an inch. Playtime Co., it seems intends to keep Elliot's name within its brand regardless, but is sure to be a long legal battle will follow. Look, they got me. There's lore. I will gladly die waiting for the lore. That's not lore. I still can't run. I hated that. Oh, I hate this. I, I cannot run. I can only walk. Is trippy. Very well done section so far. Is it purring? Guilt haunts you. Was that our office, maybe? God, I do not like turning around in here. Get up. Get up. That get up. Is get this up. the prototype talking to us? Because get up was the death message this way oh I hate the kids screaming oh hey elevator that's probably good surely nothing wrong will happen if we go to this elevator It's not an elevator, chat. Happy and fun. Why was it done? Oh, 
All right, let's see whatever horrors await us. Greetings, Hi, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts' content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed, or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are or what you've done, worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, may you descend into the Huggy dark in the for real. dust. Finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic, watching and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left. A world that's theirs now. Welcome home. Oh! Yo! Y'all wanna see a jump scare? Cause I kinda do. Yo! Yo, that's so sick. That's a fucking dope jump scare. That's sick as hell. That's fucking cool. Guys, I know I was gonna die. I'm well aware. Oh, interesting. Was that not... Was that like I was going to die no matter what? That's really cool. Exiting the TV was awesome. Hey, we got our grab pack back. the limit whatever How about you Okay, so we need to do both sides to open this door to what we're here for, I presume. I think I'm being dumb. Oh. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm being dumb. Boop. I guess that works. Anything over here? Nope.
Okay. Don't be in the gas for that long. Is there a mask in there I missed? Was it over here and I just missed it? Oh, I guess I don't need to anymore. It's not in there, so it's got to be out here, right? Oh! This! I didn't even realize that. I thought... I'm going to be super real. I thought it was like a roller skate. Because I saw that there. But I thought it was roller skates. I'm going to be real. True. Oh, thanks, chat. I'm not used to having to look down. In this entire game, I've only ever had to look up. Cool, quick travel. Uh, Jay Z Gamer 12, thank you for the l pat on the ground because I had no idea what I was doing wrong. Let me in. Oh, is this like a one way mirror to the bedroom? That's fucked. There's just so much stuff that I'm like, I want to look at everything, you know? Okay, so this seems like it's the way to progress. So let's check out whatever this was. Sorry. Was that something walking towards us? I'm planning on just streaming until we beat the game. Ideally. Okay, well now this feels like the way to progress. So which one is it, chat? The fuck? Okay, so wait, if this is the way to progress, what was that other door? What's this then? Ooh, lore, question mark? Was that like I knew or like an orange cassette tape? Like that? 
floor. Subject is stable. Designated 1322. Two. Clear neural abnormalities were detected in his recent checkup. Though highly irregular, we've pulled him from the home sweet home just before lights out to perform. What are you doing with my friend? I. What are you doing out of bed? How did you get in here? Is Kevin sick? Why did you take him away? I. I. Yes. Kevin is very sick. Very, very sick. But we want to make him better. But he can only get better if we take him to where we can provide proper care and give him proper rest. Well, do you really think he will be okay? I should think so. We're good at what we do, son. We paid attention in school, learned, and got our proper rest when we needed it. Just like you need it now, I should think. Come now. Let's get you on back to bed. Okay. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Joseph. And I promise you, your friend will be all right. When you see him again, he'll have never been better. Hated that. VHS, not cassette. You're right, I'm dummy. Just so you know, every tape is in the same room as the corresponding CV. That's huge. That's very, very good to know. Because I was really bad at keeping track of the tapes. Or... Er, keeping track of the um, VHS's in the previous chapters so thank you for that I told Amanda because uh, if y'all saw on the chat on the on the channel I had her play chapter one and chapter two because um, I don't think they're scary but she's really bad with horror games uh, she was terrified and I told her if this game isn't too bad I'm gonna make her play it <laughs> make her play it obviously she's a grown woman who has autonomy over herself but you know what I mean um but I just texted her now because she was like how's it going and I'm like yeah I'm not gonna force you. You, you you're not playing this one like you can play it if you want to but this one's much already this one is like already scarier than one and two combined watch out Okay, so there is a threat in here that could kill us. Um. Who's up breathing? Oh, hey, it's Kissy Missy. Oh, this is a sad set piece. Is that who she was? Oh, this is really sad. I'll, um... Yeah, I'll leave you to it. <laughs> so it seems like we still need a battery somewhere. Kissy Missy didn't have it, did she? Hey, sorry to bother you. I'm just, I need a battery or else I can't leave. No, I don't see any. Okay, maybe the other place wasn't just for lore, but it had a battery in it. I can see that being the answer here. Let me check that other room again.
Okay, then where's this battery? Not intimidating at all. I am loving the aesthetic so far. just missing something very obvious like two batteries I assume two batteries then I hit the button but I've there's only what, what? gotta be missing something again right and I can't do anything in Kissy's room it's just sad Oh, oh, I'm missing something. We got there. So the other battery is going to be up here somewhere. Yeah, the implications so far have been horrific. So I'll be going over there later. Oh, and now I'm over here. Got it. Understood. I I'm starting to get the lay of the land here. Let's go! Puzzle! Puzzle solved. Be free! It's a very funny puzzle mechanic. Once again, the hour of joy, not super clear. I was gonna say, those first two were your friends. That one's definitely your friend. Played unicorn? Mmm! So hungry. Hi there! I'm. Well, I'm oh, hold on. There's more there. Played unicorn? Mmm! So hungry. Hey, what do you say you and I be friends? You know, I'm okay. I think I'd rather not.
where am I taking you? Up oh, there. Got it. Understood. Is there a TV in here somewhere? There is. I almost missed that. our very own Samuel Lee. Yay. Now, before he goes, let's all give Sam one last goodbye, shall we? With me. One, two, three. Goodbye, Sam. Gross. Hated that. Okay, so that does that, and then what about this one? Puzzles. Catnap again. So there is a lot. Like, the kids love catnap. It seems, anyway. That got me a little bit. I'm going to be real. <laughs> that, that fucking got me. back down if I go to uh, no way back up if I go down there I bet it's got a battery behind it like in its back right cuz okay good game design here right in the last area it taught us it had a, a toppled over statue with a battery in its back now, we have a non-toppled over statue that keeps looking at us. So logically, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go. That, see, that's just good game design. Coming back was a mistake. Probably. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Um, where do I put this though? <laughs> Uh, well, we can... I guess we'll do the vent. <laughs> like, do we vent or do we, um... 
go down the hole. I guess we vent. Okay, so we also need two batteries for here. We got that one. Oh, the music is weird. It's like weirdly calming, but like you know why it was. Well, damn. We don't like Huggy Wuggy, apparently. Interesting. Okay. We got a couple options for our limited time. That seems like it'll take us back upstairs. Let's check this out. Okay, no way, I know what we need to do. Let's go. Hated that. We did a chat. Puzzle solving. We're so smart. A good day keeps the monsters away. Two hugs a day is better in every way. Hugging forever. Hugs are non-stop. I'm gonna hug you until you fall. Probably. Alright. Sending it. It's good to know that you can ride them. That's very fun. Someone was angry, right? Like, the scratches on the walls, the destroyed things, that's that's one thing. That's like, okay, monster going crazy. Someone was angry to be doing this. Who the hell said my brain is wrinkly? I'll have you know I iron that shit out every night so it's nice and smooth. Was that loud? Like, I don't know how loud the game should be. Okay, so it's just that room. Again, these rooms have like... Hold on, we can see the other side. Because that's where we came from, right? We're going to have to stop back there to see if you can actually even notice. I'll do that now. I'm curious if we can actually even see a window at all. Or if it's just like wallpaper for this side. Yeah, that's fucked. Oh, that's so cool. You'll never know what wall you're being looked at through. There it is.
Yeah, someone is pissed. Someone isn't just an angry monster. This is like, like, vent art, essentially. So does this just go back upstairs? Okay, yeah. That's the, uh-oh, did you fuck up? Go back upstairs and get the battery button. Yeah, that still doesn't work, I figured. All right, what man-made horrors beyond our comprehension await us? Puzzle solving, let's go. What was this? Oh, fun, okay. So, ye turret. Oh, oh, we have a gun. Okay, so the question is why do we need to do this? I guess just because it has power and we don't. Okay, that's fine. That's fair. Valid, I guess. What am I aiming at? Oh, I see. I see, okay, so then. We have a gun. How does this thing go up, is my question. Oh, it just does. All right, that's fine. Fair enough. What did that get for? Then open this door? Interesting. Oh, I probably need both of them active at the same time. Okay. Hmm. Okay, puzzle solving brain. How much can I aim this? No, I can't aim this over there. Oh, wait, did I, do? I, I solved the puzzle, apparently. I'm just, I, I just didn't look to see what happened. Oh no, is this where I came from? This is where I came from. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Shortcut. So where can this shoot? Maybe I just have to be faster? Because there's a moment where both of those are active. Okay, there's gotta be another way. I I'm doing something wrong here.
Oh wait, I know what I'm missing. I know. What I'm, hold on. Oh, we're we're so we're oh, okay. I got it. I I now under I saw the matrix. We're there. We're back. We're so back. I'm sorry, chat. Puzzle solving, man. That's what it was. We got there. We got there. Just took a little bit. A little bit of puzzle solving. Gross. go oh this is where we came from okay so I guess we turned on power we can leave now okay understood now this is where the gas monster was but I've got a mask now so we'll be fine Someone just said, wait, go back? What do you mean? There's nothing to do in the room. There was a hand? I don't think the game would have let me miss an entire upgrade to the grab pack. I'm going to be super real for a bit. Um, oh. No, hey, buddy. No, no! Let go! They didn't do anything wrong. Actually here to help. <sighs> this place makes her tense. I'm glad that all hey, of you get this far. He's the reason we found you at all. I like that we just got choke slammed. Looks like the train crash hurt us both. <sighs> You've been through so much. Yeah, thanks to you. You deserve an explanation. Thank Come on. you. Hey, you'll be okay. We'll be okay. Guys, we're going on a lift. It's just like Ban Ban. <laughs> I had to. I'm sorry. I had I'm to. I'm not your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. What's happening down here is bigger than all of us, and I need you so we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you, who've tortured us. They didn't act alone. They're disciples of the original, the prototype. Do the honors. Sure. Something else I'm supposed to do? I hit, I hit the button. I hit it again. Do I go over? No, I can't fit over there. Do I come back? Ah. The prototype oh, she's knows so scared. If you try to escape, he'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you, how capable you are. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. 
you freed me. You are perfect for this. Catnap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. We can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. What do you mean, keep myself safe? What do we, uh, where, where do I go? <laughs> hey, hey, it's me again. Welcome it back, Ollie. Like Poppy explained everything now. Not it's everything. The dome's backup power. Now the plan from here is pretty simple. We need to restore power to the gas production zone. First, go back to the home sweet home building you were just in. You should be able to find a big power cord somewhere around the porch. Grab it and plug it in underneath the statue. This? That'd be it. Big ass power cord. Very funny. What a terrible system for power management. Are you kidding? This is very silly. Uh, I guess this way. There. Okay, what if I just... What if I just keep going? How much slack did... Did they just give me unlimited slack? We're about to find out, huh, chat? We're gonna find out if there's any if there's any limit to this slack. It's still going. What if I hold on, what if I go back out? And then this way? <laughs> It's still going. <laughs> and now we'll wrap this way. <laughs> We're cord testing today, chat. Imagine I soft lock. That'd be really funny. We <laughs> I'm too I'm too focused on this. It's a speedrun strat I'll be flinged to the train in an instant. True. Okay, here's the real question. I could do this all day. It seems like there's no end to it. What if we plug it in? Awesome. Look it at that. stays. That Let's go. I, I hope so desperately that this stays for the rest of the game. Uh, the school. It's got to be this place, right? This? This look? Hmm. Oh, wait. He's sending me the key. Doi. Don't forget the key, Rai. The delay is killing me. <laughs> office, playhouse, school. Okay, that might be the office, actually. That's the playhouse. This might actually be the school, because it's got the, like, school dome thing. What's interesting to me, I don't know how much of this place I should be exploring and how much we'll just get to later on in the chapter. 
But what's interesting to me is that the toy store isn't uh, low power like everything else is. It's offline. But I don't even think we're going in there looking at the state of it. Cool. Oh, it's Boxy Boo. What a friend. Uh, I am going to do one more very brief BRB. I'm not going to even go to a BRB screen because I have to go to the bathroom. I just got to pee. The bathroom's like right down the hall. I'll be right back.
Hello, 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 chat. We're back. Sorry for the delay. IBS gang rise up. Anyway. Okay, make this quick. Turn on the generator, leave, and plug the school's power cord into the center. Be careful in there. I don't think I can connect to you on that side of the dome. And you won't be alone. Thanks, Ollie. You think you could have sped up what the danger was? This is Miss Delight speaking. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. And no going in the halls without a hall pass. Okay, so I guess it's Miss Delight. I, I guess Miss Delight is the thing we're going to have to avoid. math be smart like an elephant one plus two equals three reading is fun school rules oh this is miss delight hello okay pay attention do your homework play fair respect authority stay in your seat until the bell is wrong gross it's going to be a human looking thing not excited So this is like the teacher's lounge, I guess. Oh, she's crip walking. Okay. I see you, girl. Um, okay, so two batteries and we'll have access to... How? Oh, I can drop in, I guess. Hmm. Is there a thing underneath it? Hold on. Like a movable purple pad? No? Okay. Maybe I have to come back then. Because, like, I see this. Well, if we end up walking in a vent... Oh, wait, is this grabbable here? No. And we have a left or a right. Go left. Or go that way, actually. There was shit over here. Oh, here's a battery. Easy peasy. Let's go. Go ahead and put this back. Put this bad boy away. Plug. Sometimes it's just that easy, chat. Okay, so now I have to go towards that area. Oh, wait, no, there's another door here. Or is this the same room I was in? Okay, this is the same room. Got it, got it. All right. Now we have to go towards uh, Miss Delight, I guess. Wait, I recognize you. Yes, I remember. You used to work here. How yep. are you? Alive. Hmm? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co-workers. Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety. Who's Barb? Hey, yo, Miss Delight, who are you talking to? Also, I kind of like that she doesn't immediately seem aggressive. 
Right? Like, she's like, what are you, how are you alive? Why are you here? Catnap wouldn't like you to be here. You should leave. And then Barb's like, and then Barb's like, rah, 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 rah. and she's like, oh, yeah, no, you should go. It's interesting that she's, like, telling us to leave before, like, n she's not just like, oh, a person, I'm going to kill you. It's like, oh, you need to leave. That's interesting. Yellow tape, yellow tape. Oh, <laughs> I instinctively hit F to like use a flashlight. Sure. Thank you for the incredibly kind ten dollars. Yellow's in the hall. Wait, but I was told it's not in the same room. It's right next to it, though. Where are the kids? Please, where are the children? Are they in the same place as the employees? No. Are the children safe? Can I see them? No. And that was it. That's all he'd tell me. <laughs> Page underscore Turner super shatted nine dollars and ninety nine cents. Fair I warning for all. everyone not reading chat. Beware of triggers. The lore of this chapter is sad. Hope you're in a good headspace. Also, this boss is scary. Thank you, Foxy. Okay, so she's gonna kill them all. Interesting. So she's crazy. I do like a woman a little crazy. Oh, hey, I got a thing. Okay, so blood on paper. The pit in me howls for food. I can't think about anything other than how hungry I am. Hardly have the strength now to pick myself off the floor. Barb speaks to me, though. She gives me the strength. She gives me strength. I found that if I stand still, completely still, everyone thinks I'm dead. Barb says I need to eat and that the other teachers would, ne would never see me coming. Anything to stop the howling. Oh! So, th so the people or toys down here started eating each other because they were hungry. Interesting. Gross. Interesting. But gross. But interesting. Interesting. Talk about something funny like Pokemon? No, we're immersed. Did I have a thingy for this? A long ways. I, it barely lasts a year. That can't be the answer. Hmm. 
Oh, wait. Aha. Sometimes the puzzles just look around. And that's okay, because I don't do that very often. She kind of, like, gallops. Not a good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs, too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out. Oh, I see. So you can open doors once you get across them sometimes. Good to know. Hate it. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. Did you know that there are 60,000 miles of blood vessels in the human body? For comparison, the Earth around the equator is almost 25,000 miles. The smallest bone in your body is the states in your ear. Still, damage it, and you risk losing your hearing. Want to learn more about human organs? Pay close yes, Mr. attention Light. in class. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. So this three notes we just didn't see. Great. I'm so sorry I had to eat. I had to survive. I ate them. I had to. I had to. I had to. I had to. We're getting very cooking companions in here. God damn. So I'm missing three other notes. I, I would sure like that flashlight. Oh, she's gross. Gross. I had to know. We had to see the jump scare. That was a good jump scare. That was a good jump scare. I like a death animation jump scare that shows you getting killed. Cool. Let's do it again. Not that way. Very fleshy, which is interesting. So go back this way. I assume we're still running because I hear her behind me. Okay, she doesn't move if we're looking at her. Good to know.
Oh, I hate I hate the noise she makes. Okay, this is good for me. This is fucking tense, dude. Music go crazy. Oh, you know, it was back there, huh? The drum's going crazy. That's how I got in here. I need two. Okay, I found one. There's got to be one over here, then. Okay, got it. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. I've understood. Okay, battery time, I guess. Still no clue on what the hour of joy is. Is she stuck? I don't know. I'm just happy she's not here. Think she got stuck somewhere? That's really funny. Well, I'm glad she did, because fuck that. Maybe when my hand got stuck on the thing, it like fucked with her or something. I don't care. I'm happy that it happened. Jesus Christ. Oh no, she's here. She's here, all right. Gross. Hated that. Hated that, hated that, hated that. Yeah, we missed the first three notes. God damn it. The door opened today and I heard something enter my hall. Together, Barb and I found Catnap waiting. All this time, all this agony, it was he who locked the door. I know it. I wanted to kill him, but knew better than to believe I could. He seemed oddly glad to see I was all that remained. 
We made a deal. We take care of each other now. Report what we see to each other and to him. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me? All three with me. One, two, three! <laughs> Didn't get very far, did we? Nope. Again! One, two, three! Nope. Still didn't make it. Listen, this won't stop until we make it to the moon. One, two... No, oh, no! Don't look at your feet! None of that matters! Again! Again! Jump! Jump! I tried, Hoppy. I've got a gun now. Let's go. What happens when I shoot off hot? It just takes a while to reload. Understood. How fucking expansive is this place? Jesus Christ. Oh, uh, great. Okay. I need to find a cassette for you. Oh, easy enough. You stupid, clunky elevator. What was that, Ricci? Nothing, nothing. Let's just get this shipment dropped and go. I take it you're not a fan of this place, are you? Nope. Never liked the feel of it. I mean, don't you think these kids deserve some real sunlight instead of floodlights and painted skies? Hell, we're not even allowed to talk to these kids. Isn't that... <clears throat> <sighs> Sorry, Stu. Sorry? <laughs> that doesn't sound like the rich I know. Well, trying to stop being so pissed off all the time. My wife says I'm a lovely man, but I gotta control my temper. So, I'm doing it for her. <laughs> Wait, this... Uh, Richie is Michael Kovac? Awesome. Love him. Rich. Honest to a fault. But, uh, I always liked that about you. Yeah? <laughs> well, you're one of the few. Uh, you know, Richie, with my retirement coming up, uh, they've been pushing hard for me to choose my replacement. I'm thinking about giving the role to you. But, uh, really? Really? Nothing official yet. But I think there's a decent guy beneath all that crap. An honest, hardworking man. You prove me right. I said your chances are pretty good. Wow, I, uh, geez, I don't know what to say. I, I'm just glad to see not everyone in this place has it out for me. Not everybody, Rich. Not everybody. Well, that's a nice, this is a nice scene between two guys. Two fellas. Oh yeah, we don't take fall damage anymore. Oh, okay, don't go there. <laughs> I, I was confused.
Ow. <laughs> it just powered this up. That was tight. Once again, huge Portal 2 vibes, um, in a good way. If for anyone who hasn't played Portal 2, the, the, one of the final acts is you fall underneath the uh, facility and there's this massive cave expanse that it goes into. Oh, so we got a lot of shit to think about here. Where is the beginning of it? Okay, so that's what we need to hit. <laughs> Oops. Here it is. Okay, so we're starting with you. So if we start with you... All right, pretty straightforward. Sending it. Huge win. How's the game so far? Really good. Nice and spooky. This is the shrine of the proto prototype in here? For curiosity's sake. I said look left. I don't see it. Um, so either, either it's something that comes later that we saw in the trailer, or I'm blind, because I don't see what you're talking about. Oh, we go down here. Interesting. Where's this go? Oh, death. Is it like far off over here? Because we are heading that way. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. I'm just gonna ignore chat as I should be doing cause spoilers. I do wanna check this down area though. just there because I guess Ooh, almost did not make that what did that do for me oh I see.
Up we go. Is that catnap? I know what that is. What is that? That's catnap. Holy. So yeah, that's the shrine we saw in the trailer. He looks fucking gross. I don't like that catnap can stand on two legs. Frankly, I hate that. Yeah, I should have expected he'd go away the second I looked away. Gross. Okay, so yeah, I'm just going to disregard chat. Sorry, guys. Um, <laughs> fucking, oh, look left. You, uh, you could have seen it. I literally couldn't until I beat the puzzle. You don't know what you're talking about. And also, spoilers. So, uh, you know what? Just because I'm being kind of petty. Later. Because not only were you giving me wrong information and delaying the stream, uh, you were spoiling it. So, have fun. T post for dominance, true. Oh, not the playhouse. This was literally the place we were told not to go to. It's just endless. Don't worry about it, chat. Ugh. You know what? It does feel a little harsh. Instead, I'll just time them out for a day. That's everyone's warning. Uh, gamer boy, you've been unbanned, but you have been timed out for a day. So, the chat, that's your warning. That'll be the only timeout I give today. Oh, I went backwards. Oops. This way. No, I, I'm the only reason it wasn't a ban is because it does seem genuine, like genuinely like an accident. But uh, that's everyone's warning. My mer my mercy has a very very fine line. Oh hey, it's Bear Hug. Hi, I'm Bobby Bear Hug. Want to know how much I love you? <laughs> What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Was that the fucking pig? I love you to the moon and back. I'm crazy about you. I'm lost without you. I've been lost a long time. Please, take me with you this time. You won't leave me, will you? Hi, I'm Bobby Bear Hug. Want to know how much I love you? Okay, so there is a tape somewhere in here for that.
That was the pig for sure. Tape? VHS tape? Okay, so it's probably in here then. Pro tip, shoot at the ceiling. It lights up the room very nicely. It's in a tent further up. Thank you. Yeah, that's the only thing I'll permit. If I'm like looking for one of these tapes and I just am not seeing it, feel free to tell me where it is. Okay, this is catnap. Uh, experiment number 1188. What's his real name again? Ah, okay. <clears throat> hey, Theo. How you doing, bud? Normally I'd have Dr. Sawyer do this, but he's uh out, let's say. So you got me until they find his replacement. First off, congrats. This is officially your fourth year in your new body, and you've made some real progress, pal. I was told that when you and the other smiling critters, you know, dog day, picky piggy, yada yada yada, were added into play care, that you weren't really getting along too well with the kids like everybody else was. But look at you now. The kids love you, and that red smoke, I mean, that's fantastic, isn't it? Oh, I have Reese, welcome, uh, hello. Voice thing, he's still broken. That is the first time we've heard Theo, Catnap speak. Nobody's gonna save you. This prison is where you belong. We'll let you out here and there to go see the kids in play care, but your home is here. And as for the prototype, his home is in the labs. This is your life now. Get used to it. So Sawyer is missing. Um... Interesting. Also, I am Reese. Welcome, welcome. I didn't even know you could rate on YouTube. That's hype. How is your stream, Reese? Uh, it's been great so far. I've been loving it. So I have to hit it. I have to hit it directly. Good to know. <laughs> Hate that. away from me. There's so many of you little assholes. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh my god, how many are there?
god, this is there's so many of them. I thought there'd be like one every now and then. Got stuck there for a second, but we're fine. You think they're cute? You're wrong, but I mean, you're allowed to be wrong. Man, the thing that sucks, if this wasn't like a horror movie death trap, this would be a really fun place to play as a kid. It's like Chuck E. Cheese, like play tubes on crack. This seems really fun. go up I want to go up I think you're stuck I say, oh Jesus Christ so any of them kill me Oh, this is a dangerous place to be. I want uppies. <laughs> oh, this is a dangerous place. Okay. Hold on, I think we can break this chat. Oh, they might have programmed it so you can't stand up there, which, like, they should have, but I'm hoping they didn't. <laughs> they are all getting just clustered there. intended way. Uh, yeah, Reese. So far, this is by far my favorite. Just for the fact that it's actually very scary so far. And I would argue chapters one and two, personally, not scary. Um, like, they were fun, but they weren't really scary. Whereas this one, I'm like, unsettled. Wait, how did we get in here? Oh, this way. I think I broke the smiling critters too, so pog. If anyone wasn't here, the school I broke Miss Delight and she just kind of didn't bother us after the first area. I think all the smiling critters are stuck there, so that's that's good for me. I'm 
not everybody. Of course, catnap's the one that stole problem. I hit both of the things, but I don't know what that did for me. Oh, I see. I understand now. I was like, how am I supposed to run that fast? They extend, dummy. <laughs> Fuck off. I hate these fucking things. I want to, like, explore the area, but I don't want to. Because I'm getting chased down by a thousand motherfuckers. Okay, that looks like progression, so let's go up first. Mrs. Delight was your op? Luckily, we only had to deal with her once, and then she got stuck, so she was great. <laughs> once we dealt with her that one time, we were fine. Okay, yeah. Up is just blocks. That's fine. Pool. I can go for some playtime lemonade. The set design in this game so far has been just. Who is that? They're in the walls, chat. They're in the walls. The set design so far has been just top notch. Oh, this is like a jail. Oh, is this where we're going to see that one tied up motherfucker you, from the trailer? You're a Pappy's angel. Oh, shit! Nothing left to save. Not here. Or a catnap's home, angel. There, home. A murderer pairs of eyes are on you now. Watching. Waiting. Hungry. They want nothing more than to crawl beneath your skin and eat away at you bit by little bit. Fill what feels empty inside themselves. That thing, Catman, the prototype is his god, and this is what he does to heretics. These little toys follow Catman to avoid that very fate. And in return, they are fed. <clears throat> we try to fight it. The prototypes control. I am the last of the smiling critters. Listen to me. You need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torment. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Please. Just go! Oh, gross! I can't, uh, use this door. Okay, so run backwards is what I've learned. Gross! Oh, jamming music, though. We're all the way back here.
Good, good jump scare. Pretty good jump scare. Yeah, this versus where we like chapter one and two. Like it's no. the best test. Leave me. Very chapter one, but that's fine. Oh, he's he is there. We are not far ahead. Fuck off. Okay, so they don't give a shit about the lights anymore. If you see them down a tunnel, go the other way. Understood. I feel that, Reese. Like, the this chapter is so distinct from 1 and 2. And I liked 1 and 2. But, like, Jesus. This is just, like, on another level. This just feels like a new, like, a separate game. It's crazy. Um, Cure the Wolf, fine, but I'm not going to look at it. But chat, if anyone's curious, Cure the Wolf said that there's a spoiler-free uh, trigger warning that they're going to provide. I'm not going to look at it. I'll be fine, but any people in chat might need it, so that's a fair point. killed me so we'll go left left was the dead end okay we're going this way come on come on we go 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 different end different end let's go fucking follow me now dumbass let's go standing there you can't be here you can't stay oh damn I like that those are two separate things. Whatever you say. <laughs>
What about the school, Ollie? Catnap. Every shadow and every flickering light is a hiding spot. He always stalks his prey first. He'll take away anything you have to defend yourself. And when you're at your most vulnerable, he'll kill you. Catnap lives for the hunt. Good luck. Talk soon. But I did the school so we could use that. Whatever. Whatever. Into the office we go. So this is the counselor's office. Which, the way he phrased it, we're facing off against Catnap. The court did reset, unfortunately. Oh, happy birthday, White Wolf. Your tools won't protect you. Yeah, doubt. I've got a gun. And right now, my tools are not letting me get through these doors. I just need to look around a little bit. Ooh, new VHS? Where's the TV for it? Oh, let's find the VHS first. VHS right here. Is, I don't want to accidentally progress and lose access. Is it in this room or is it a little bit further ahead? Oh. I found it. <laughs> oh, that had a date on it. Interesting. Workforce danger alert. The following message is for all Playtime Company employees. At 11.01 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, an unknown hostile force was declared present within the Playtime Company facility. Personnel are to begin enacting emergency evacuation protocols immediately. Leave all personal belongings. Do not engage with any hostile individuals. If no exit path is available, seek shelter in a hidden location. Use blankets or pillows to cover your body and remain silent. Do not look through any windows. Do not open doors for any individuals. Do not make eye contact. Cool. Oh, open the doors now. The hour of joy has arrived. Interesting. Did the hour of joy happen before the gameplay? Um, I need to go. It's cold, so you guys are going to say, I just bought a blanket hoodie. So I'm just going to go put it on. It's cold as shit. Alright, we're cozy. We are now cozy. It's like a Snuggie, but it wraps all the way around. It goes down to my feet and has a hood. This is the coziest thing I've ever owned. Chad, I fucking love this.
All right. Stay energized. Pour coffee on your head. Oh. Huh? Oh, those are two giant eyes for a second. Mark wants to say hi to, to the stream. Oh. The hour of Mark has arrived. Big boy. Big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy. Da boy. I'm just going to do this so he can stay. Da big boy. Ban ban face? Put, look, I hate Ban Ban as much as the next guy, but even I know the fucking name is Zolfius. Thank you very much. It does kind of look like two eyes, right? Am I crazy? That's probably on purpose. Can we get that battery that we put in? It looks like we might need it. No, they made that purposely. You cannot. Not the microphone. That's expensive. He's a toasty boy. He's getting toasted just like me. Oh, wait. That was a name. Maria Ashoka. That's a new name as far as I'm aware. Bunzo. Oh. Bunzo just got fucking eated. He got eight. Jesus Christ. Well, damn. My boy Bunzo. Thank you, Queen Coda. Also, thank you for the 10 months. Very kind. Cannot stand on my desk. Bunzo found dead in Miami. Eduardo Gala. Boogie bot. What a guy. So these are the heads of here, because this is head of Toy Store. This is the other head. Queen Coda, uh, I think that's what we called getting fucking wrecked. Why is this? We go into this cave a lot, dude. Oh, we go up or down. All right, well, what's up? Up is probably a progression, right? Maybe. Uh, uh oh, I see. 
We need to power that on. Got it. Oh, I see. So this is... Okay, there's nothing down here. It's just that if you fuck up, you'll fall down there. Oh, we're puzzle solving. Okay, so I can't jump back while it's powered on. Can I reach it from here? Oh, I can. Okay. Not a super hard puzzle. We got there. Shit. Alright, that was just a skill issue. <laughs> that was just straight up a skill issue. God damn it, the tomatoes again. I gotta... The tomatoes are like one of the things that make me... That does make me want to start multi-streaming on Twitch. Because with channel point redeems... I had it so you guys could use channel points to literally... Like, have a video of a tomato being thrown at me happen. I will not have this fucking mutiny. Once again, skill issue, understandably. What? Okay, so I need to activate that up again to get across, I guess. Chat is going... Chat is in a fucking war right now. It's alright, Mark is safe in the toaster. Huge. I meant to hit E, and instead I hit F by accident, and I scared myself. Stella Graber is the head of play care. I thought that was true. We knew that from chapter two, right? Pink cassette tape. Easy enough. Please have a seat. 
How was your ride down? It was uh, nothing like we were expecting. Uh, Mr. Ludwig's speech was, well, it just confirms for us that you're the orphanage we want to go through. It's a truly magical place. I felt right at home from the second I entered. You open that door the first time and you just know you're never going to leave. Kind of like finding a home as a child and always thinking of it when you want to feel comforted. <clears throat> I understand you want to give Jeremy that home. Yes, and we would like to adopt. Ah, amazing. You'll be perfect for... Oh. What? Well, it appears there's been some complications. Complications? Oh, what kind of complications? I... I don't know. Um, the form says... testing. <laughs> what does that mean? Tell us, what does that mean? Miss Graper, we deserve a better explanation than that. Uh, don't you think? You're in charge of all this! How could you not know? And why are we only finding out about this now? I... I don't. I'm sorry. Yikes. Was there a key in here I needed? on one of the desks. Surely one of you were important enough to have the key. Right? Or am I misunderstanding what I'm supposed to do here? I feel like Big office, locked door, find the key for the locked door in the big office. Look up. Oh, am I misunderstanding what I'm supposed to do again? God damn it. Oh. Oh, the key was on there. That's a big fucking key. Time is running short. Turn and go home. Thanks. I can't. Now, I literally can't leave. Give me some red? More red, please. What? But we can't be out. You're hiding more red from me. I know you are. Give it here. Well, I guess we know who's been uh, leaving all the uh, fucking. Uh, messages on the walls for us. I, I just love the, just, if you shoot the ceiling, suddenly the whole room is lit up and you can see. The Arrow of Joy. Help! Who's pissing in here? This one. Oh, 
Why do I feel like this won't end well for us? Can I take it off in here? Nope. We're just wearing this mask now. So I need to electricity that at some point. But with what? It's locked. Oh, there's a lot of rooms we can go into. So this is head of gas production, Nate Carpenter. Have you tried venting, Gregory? God damn it. Okay, so there's another one of those. I know it will be hard for you to be sus. Have you heard of the game Among Us? Head of Playhouse, Greg Facto. So a lot of bases to use, not a lot of sources of them. Unless that's also through the hole. No. Interesting. just be something in this room. It's just very hard to see with the mask on. Oh. Let's be the devil. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Okay, so we're fine in here now. Damn. I was like, can I cheese it? Six hundred and sixty-six folks watching. That must be a sign. Also, make sure to like the stream because it helps in the algorithm. Um. Okay. So wait. What did that do for us? Why are we just up here now? So we need to unlock that first. And then what do we got over here? Oh, that's gonna be fun. Okay, so that's lined up. I guess, let's see what happens when we do this. Oh, we did something. Cool. Okay, that it just took a second. Talk about Portal. This just really makes me want to play Portal. For real. 
Uh, okay, so this is good. A little tricky. I guess just try to land on each one. Not do it like a... Not do one fluid motion, just... Yeah, there we go. Right, so now we're up here. Huge. Can this aim at the other thing? It can. Okay, so what does that one do? Seemingly nothing. All right. Uh, oh, we can use this down here, though. Uh, oh, this is what the lift is for. I got it. We have to break the um, casing by dropping it from a high place. One. Okay, so now, are you still aimed at the right thing? Turn that off. Um, actually, wait, no, I need to get back up first. We're learning. We're gaming. Oh, shit. Wait, how? What? That I was on the elevator, right? Like, am I crazy? sound mind sometime? Uh, I can look, check it out. I've never heard of it before. Actually, you know what? That's not true. I uh, A streamer I watch played like a 45 minutes of it because he was doing like a spin the wheel thing. I didn't really see what it was about, but Jay-Z Jay Gamer 12, thank you for five months. Yo, yo, yo. Thank you very much. The smooth jazz is unexpected. I'll be honest. You cannot be on the desk. Dead by the original's command? I guess dead because Daddy Prototype told me to. Prototype has saved us all. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yada, yada, yada. A lot of yapping in the form of writing. It was kind of funny that the chair turned towards me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Didn't expect that. I, 
I was chilling, but okay. Oh, we're high as shit. Oh, we're going on a trip. Do you have any idea what you're doing? No, obviously not. I love the cloud models here. They're very pretty. Do you know what's happened here? I have a feeling. I'm pretty sure I know what it, what kind of shit was going down here. Zooted out of our board right now. True. Before I was drugged, that this was a problem. Do you even know what's real? Not right now. Why is that funny though? Wait, why is that funny? No, you don't. Prototype. Okay, prototype. I think I like catnapped better when he didn't talk. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to go back in, so I guess we should leave, huh? No, we were definitely an employee. Oh, damn it. Keep getting turned around. This way. We would have, we could have catnap exactly. Something's gone wrong. Grab the cord from the counselor's office and plug it in underneath the statue. We need to reach a hundred percent. Good luck. Where is the cord, though? Okay, we still have a mask. Ah. Probably shouldn't fuck around as long with this one, huh? keys to ninety six percent sounds good enough to me
Let's go. Uh. Uh. I'm going to assume I was meant to be in here. Chad, I didn't skip anything, right? Like, that was supposed to close behind me, not in front of me? Because it did close behind me. I'm just going to assume that was meant to happen. Okay, that was supposed to happen. Cool, cool, cool. Been a while since we've been in here. There was one more plug I needed to do. Are you sure? I did the plugs. Okay, well, the door's open, so that's all that matters. All right, let's find the school. We're not soft locked. That's all that me. That's all that is. Uh, that all that. That's all that matters. Words. Uh, yeah, I, I. You know what? No, you're right. I never did the school because we did the school. We left the play care, and he was like, "You need to go to the counselor's office." But he never told me to like go back to the school, so I didn't think to. Now I gotta find the school in the dark. God damn it. It was like up here. Uh, is oh, is that the? No, that's a gazebo. Where's the school? It's dark as shit. Oh, you know what? Is the school there? There's the school. This was the plug I needed? Yeah, I had no idea that was the plug I needed. That's crazy. At least it was beeping. It did not click that there was a plug after the whole Kissy Missy cutscene. Got it. Separate issue. That door is now closed when it was open before. What if it doesn't open, chat? Okay. Phew. <laughs> that also got me worried. When Mr. Light showed up, she smashed the generator. Oh, you're right. You're right. I did that didn't click that that's what happened to be honest. But I think that's more the fact that it's 1 a.m. Theory on who Ollie is? I really don't know yet. Big battery. Oh shit. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, he's so creepy. Oh, I love it. He's so creepy. Good design. All 
All right, so it's big boss fight time. I have to do this every time. There, there had to have been a closer checkpoint, y'all. I'm just saying. You could have had a. If the ch the checkpoint for the boss fight should not be that far, right? It's got to be that we fucked it up because we didn't do this plug, right? That makes that makes more sense. That our checkpoint got fucked up because we didn't do the plug. I'm not supposed to have my mask? I do have my mask. Whatever we did, because I didn't do that one plug we were supposed to, uh, must have fucked up some stuff. I, I just have a knack for accidentally fucking up games. My bad. Alright, well, this is gonna suck that we have to go through this every time, but whatever. Oh, he's so gross. Oh, he's the thing that doesn't have color. Interesting. So when he uses his gas, he loses color. Oh, he's fucking gross. <laughs> I guess we don't really need the mask. He's disgusting. Checkpoint is the last plug plugged. Damn it. Alright, well that, that that was a loading zone, so that's gotta be a checkpoint. Oh my god. A lot of shit we can do now. Okay, so that protects me from something coming, I guess. Okay, so I guess he's going to come from one of these things, and we have to block him off. Behind this terminal, Beeler Canop is near.
Okay, we've learned. We've learned. I know what's going on now. He's gross. Stop before I miss the tape. There's a tape here? Where? This dude just switches before I can even make him go away. Was the ceiling? Wild. Okay, there's a tape here, you said? back here. Oh, we have to close the ceiling. I see. It's in one of the hallways. Relation, experiment 1006, the prototype. Stubborn as he is, and always silent with each passing session, I'm still uncovering fresh data nonetheless. Today's discovery... <laughs> End of log. Ready to talk now? A question. Go ahead. Do you feel anything? <sighs> this question referred to what exactly? You stick us, beat us, tear our flesh. Do you feel it? There's a secret inside you. Valuable beyond all measure. I cut and prod and burn at it. And I get closer with each session. So speak. Or oh, don't. Fight. Or give in. Regardless, I learn something new about you every day. <laughs> it excites me. Thank you. Interesting. All right. Catnap is coming. Be ready. All right, room in the front and back. There should be small alcoves with terminals ready for a charge. See for yourself. Okay, yeah, I saw those.
Do I get to do I have to get close again? Alright, let me. One of these four receivers. Okay, so okay. So I can start on easy mode with the batteries, but eventually I need to use all four of these. Right, one, two, three, four. Or I guess one, two, three, four. So it'll get harder and harder as we go. But in the meantime, I only have to worry about the front two because these will be always on. All right, I I've learned, we know, we got this. his face up there wait how many are there oh there's multiple oh gross Hate his gross ass body. Wall him up here. So we're going sicko mode. Oh, I inserted the wrong battery. Oh shit. I'm just gonna start guessing chat and being real. Get it. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, gross. Oh. Wait, it's kind of sweet though. Oh. It's not sweet. Oh, prototype has a long arm. So I don't have a green hand anymore.
Well, uh, I guess I'll be going now. Not sure exactly where. That's where it came from. Yeah, his name was Theo. Deserved. I mean, yes, deserved, but gross. A little sad, but deserved. I mean, at least he's finally dead. I'm sure none of them want to be alive here. Honestly, that's probably the most likely outcome, is that Catnap knew he was about to die, so he willingly offered himself up. Back to the elevator? Oh, okay. Oh, right, because we have to put the blue battery away. I walked in, and it didn't automatically move, and I forgot that there's a fucking button. Alright, let's go deal with the gas. That was a great monster design, I have to say. That was disgusting. Hey, Amanda Panda with the incredibly kind SCK-50. I don't know what SCK is, but thank you. That's very, very kind of you. Judging by the color, I think I know about how much it is, but regardless, thank you. No matter how much it is. Amanda Panda super chatted $4.78. I can't believe it's finally here. Just woke up and don't want to spoil anything for myself, so I'm going to watch this from the beginning. Sparkling heart, sparkling heart. Everything is falling into place thanks to you. Where are you? But if we're to keep going, then then you deserve to have the truth. You came back because of your co-workers. We want to know what happened and why. Lord, 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 this, Lord, Lord, Lord. This is your answer. We Lord, 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 Lord. The power of joy. Lord, 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 Lord. GXLDFNCH super shattered one dollar and ninety nine cents. Why do people think Elliot is prototype? I don't know. Doesn't make sense to me. Shit. That's a way to kill someone. Oh, 
it's Boxy Boo. Hi, Boxy Boo. You're my guy. Oh, that's a lot of dead people. That's a lot of dead people, chat. That's a lot of people. I remember hearing every moment of it. It went on so long, so agonizingly long. I tried to hide. Happening. What are those things? <laughs> Senseless slaughter. That's all it really was. They killed everyone. The guilty, the innocent. It didn't matter. All of that death didn't fix anything. And then, once it was all over, they dragged those corpses down below where they'd never be found. And they ate the bodies to stay alive. Prototype has to die for this. I for everything. You. Soon as we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Just hold tight, okay? After She's going to die. No way she survives after that. She's too innocent, and we're leaving her behind. She's going to die. All right. Once we hit the ground, we need to be cautious. There's something... What I tell you, chat. I know how this shit works. Ah, <sighs> good chapter. Jesus. Once I heard, um, w once we get to the bottom, we'll send the lift back up for you. I'm like, oh, she's dead. <laughs> Um, good chapter. Ugh. Yeah, we could have turned the handle with our grab pack. She didn't have to stay behind. Oh, no, we were kind of deep. We, the, we didn't have an angle. But, like, there was another option. Ollie, still not seeing Ollie is crazy. I'm very curious to see what Ollie is. Chapter four has got to be the finale. Yeah, I think so. Either either chapter four is the finale or chapter five. Uh, but I don't see more than like one or two chapters. I love when people just say shit. I'm not trying to be rude. Crimson Shadow 339. I'm going to call you out. There's six chapters confirmed, by the way, guys. Source? You got a fucking source for that, or are you just saying shit? And and I'm, I'm calling out some of you other fuckers in chat. Two of you is. Oh, really? There's six? There's six? Guys, don't just believe a random chatter. Like, I don't think they've ever once... Like, if there is, sure. I, I believe it. But, like, is there a source for that? 
Or is the source that you, it came to you in a dream? My source, Senator, is that I made it the fuck up. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> um, yeah, Google did no, no source. Yeah, exactly. Um, really, really good chapter. I would say... One, like, one and two were fun. This one was not only fun, but actually genuinely scary. But no, it was actually genuinely scary. So that's pretty good. Um... go over the OSHA violations in this chapter? <sighs> I kind of want to. But the thing is, like... I don't know. I'm definitely... This week's video is going to be on this game. But I don't know if I want to do a lore recap or the, um... Or if I'd rather do, like, Poppy Playtime Redeemed Itself and talk about how much scarier and how well done this was. I don't know. Because that, that monster design was, one, really good, and two, almost always concealed until it was pretty much dead, which is great. Um, this was really, really solid. They really upped the ante in a very fun way. Um, Dog Day's death was very brutal. Do both. If I do two Poppy Playtime videos in a, in a row, uh, my channel will firebomb into the ground. Because uh, <laughs> it's not FNAF. Um, do you think John FNAF will live stream this game? I don't know. <laughs> if he does, he's going to have a rough time with it. Uh, it my, boy, my boy a little squeamish. Um, I, I believe in him, though. Um, Dog Day's area was... Fucked. Um, a lo I think probably both. I think I'll do a lore video first, then another FNAF video, and then Poppy Playtime redeemed itself question mark. Because I think a Poppy Playtime lore video will perform well comparatively. So I think lore video. FNAF video, if the lore video does well, performance video, uh, then redemption video. I think that's the, um, I think that might be the move. To those who waited patiently, thank you for your continued snap bias and all that you do and say to support this franchise. Thank you so much. Wait, it's so fast. It's so fast. How am I supposed to read it that fast? It seemed like a very sweet message. Really, really solid chapter. Who do I think killed Kissy Missy? Uh, the prototype, I assume. Oh, I'll be talking about this on the podcast for sure. Yeah, rewind the vote if you want to read it. Um, that was really, really solid. But it is 1.37 a.m. So while I've got 500 of you, before y'all leave, I'm, full of, I'm, for, I'm gonna pull up some music in the background. Um, this Friday, you should see it. When this stream ends, it will redirect you to it. So there's no excuse you will know what the uh, live stream is going to be. Now, this Friday, we will be doing... Uh, is this the right song? No. I just wanted to pull up my music. It's taking forever. I'm so cozy. This Friday... We will be doing... Oh, I can turn chat back on. 
I cannot because chat's the to Friday stream. Oops. Um, my music isn't even playing. Golly. There we go. This Friday, uh, I believe the chair. I believe the Tiltify link goes live today. Um, but we will be playing through, starting at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Friday. We will be playing Poppy Playtime Chapter One, Two, and Three as fast as possible. Uh, not necessarily a speed run because I really don't understand. The, I don't know the speed run yet. We're just going to be playing it very quickly. Um, and we're going to start at 6 p.m. FNCH super shattered one dollar and ninety nine cents. Love to you, Oud from Palestinian American heart always. Well, thank you for the very, very kind two dollars. Um, but it will be a charity stream for PCRF. That's Palestine Children Relief Fund. It is a charity that does wonderful work supporting the young people in Palestine right now during this crisis. Um, and it starts at 6 p.m. EST. Uh, it'll be this Friday. I don't know exactly how long it'll go. Probably five to six hours long. Um, but it'll basically it'll basically be a uh, three chapter speed run, but like without any uh, studying. Um, that being said. Uh, I would do a very long goodbye to everybody, but I'm going to end this so it redirects you to that stream. Make sure to hit that notify bell. If we raise $2,000, I'll be doing a stream where I try to learn and then beat Poppy Playtime Chapter 1 or 2 blindfolded. I say or because if you donate through the Tiltify link that will be provided, uh, you can actually vote on which game will be played. So it'll be really fun. I hope you all be there. I'll be there. Um... And then, what else can I think of? Oh yeah, and I'll be reiterating this on Friday. Please only go through the Tiltify link because I do not, like Super Chats take forever to clear and then I have to go back and it's just a hassle. Please just go through the Tiltify link. Um, regardless, I will see y'all on Friday. Um, later. Good night, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. This is a really fun game. And even if I should say, I see bro, I don't have money. Even if you don't have money, just being there at all is a huge help. Um, 